Hi, this is Tim. And today's automation question is about should you upload the data table values when you're saving the PLC program online? So when you go to save in your program, you just hit the save button, you get this warning. Data tape values may have changed since the last save. To make sure that current values are saved, you should perform an upload. Do you want to upload the data table values when saving? And what this is, is right now we have our own encoder simulator running so that we're incrementing value. But these values that are changing in the PLC are not necessarily what's in the RS Logics program. The RS Logics program has the values from the last time the program was uploaded, or if it was never uploaded, the default values when you created the program. So should you save every time? Um, there's two answers to this. First, if it's a machine, and yeah, you're um, always wanting the latest values, especially settings and things like that, that only change every six months or something, but you want to make sure they're in there just in case you have a machine failure, or just in case you have a PLC failure, then absolutely, you want to click the yes, upload values. And you see it goes through real quick, uploads the values, bam, you have the values that were in there at that moment, you hit the yes button. Now my values are still changing here, so what's going on over here is not getting recorded into RS Logics. So if I click save again, and I decide, nah, I don't want to do it this time, it will not have gotten the latest value. So is there ever a time that you need to hit the no button? Well, yeah, there's two reasons to hit the no button. Say, you know, you're building hundreds of the same machine and you have a default set of parameters that you don't want to change normally, then yeah, you would hit the no button there. That way you're always downloading those default parameters to the machines as you're building them. And the only other time is if you know that there's no parameter that could have changed that's super critical and you have a horribly slow connection. So like a lot of times when I'm doing um, some of the cellular um, connections we have and we're making a, a change to it, it can be, I mean, as horrible as an old telephone modem. But uh, so I'll make a simple change to the program, but I know none of the parameters were actually changed. That would be one time that I would probably hit the no button just so I didn't have to wait so long for it to upload all the values out of the PLC. So that's really quick on when you, that's a really quick blip of, you know, what that little dialogue means. Uh, like this video, please. Uh, like this video if you liked it. Uh, ask any questions you have in the comments. Till next time.